All right, everyone. It's uh, Tuesday, but I've been gone for five days, so I'm doing Misprint Mondays. I'm going to be doing a quite a few here just because I picked up a large stack of misprints while I was at the ARG circuit a uh, week before last or, or whenever it was. Um, two things. One, ARG circuit's the greatest thing ever, way better than any YCS or even the Nats that I went to as far as the event goes and the competition and what you're allowed to do and, and see and just how relaxed it is and of course the prizes but um, I'm a pretty big advocate of it I was I did all the filming all the videos you saw for that first one in Dallas or actually excuse me Fort Worth was me um, and you'll see that in Kiko's video but um, I really do uh, appreciate subscribers I've got since that and hopefully we'll get more uh, case opening is I got it in today and I was really wanting to watch, uh, excuse me, to, to do it tonight. Steve got tickets to the Thunder game, which as you guys know, if you watch basketball, Thunder's quite good. So I can't blame him for wanting to go to that instead. So I went ahead and just said, go ahead, and we're going to do it Friday. And then I want to show you these misprints uh, for Misprint Monday. Um, and I got these at the ARG circuit. I picked these up from Troll and Toad for like 50 cents. Uh, they're Guy of the Dragon Champions. And notice they're all unlimited. And they came out with a gold name instead of a secret name. So, um, I didn't really care about condition. I got this from a friend at Locals. I think it's uh, James Rowland who gave me that cool miscut uh, dark flare. This is also at the Troll and Toad booth for like, like some 50 cents. It's crimped, so not really a misprint. Um... And that's just the way it actually came, was just like that, like you see. This one I got from my friend Kyle, and he just gave it to me. Very cool of him. Um, I get a lot of my misprints for free, so if you guys want a bunch of money, good luck with that, because I get a lot of stuff given to me. Uh, okay, there it is. You see the starfoil? See how it ends, like right in the middle of the darker blue dressed uh, Toon Gemini Elf? And there's like a weird line. It just stops right there. Kind of crazy. That was really cool. And then these are, um, like I said before in my videos, if you guys watch Misprint Mondays a lot, common misprints are really rare. And I thought that was pretty sweet. So those are both, like, I guess they got too hot, is what we determined we think it is. Um, and it just smudged or, or whatever. Pretty sweet. So those are the Misprint Mondays for, uh, for today. Today's the, uh, 15th or whatever and I'm going to be uh I'll do these another day and we'll do the video Steve and I have an idea what I want you guys to do for comments is we are going to do a scavenger hunt so one card we're going to, whoever uh gets the most of that card uh we're going to do at least I think four uh we're going to do six cents of course um Steve's going to do bottomless for this bottomless party just like the last legendary collection case and then we're going to do a card that I choose, and that will be determined on the video. And then we're going to let you guys vote. So uh, whichever one gets the most thumbs up votes in the uh, comment section below, we'll, uh, we'll be searching for that. And whoever gets the most, like I said, will win. Because this is not a set that people really are killing themselves about. Uh, it's not as much to get excited about as usual. So I want to kind of let you guys run that and determine who's going to win and why. So... Please comment below. Thank you guys for watching. Click that like button. It really does help. And I'll catch you guys uh, Friday night. Later.